Hello Galaxy of Heroes. So this is um, yesterday's um, yesterday's GAC. Um, I'm just waiting. 10 o'clock tonight is the final round of this season. Um, some mistakes were made and there's also a little bonus thing at the end. Actually, I've made it the screenshot. So uh, what I also managed to do, and it's tagged on at the end, is the I want that ship um, feat from GAC, hence what, the, which is why it's on there. So although it's a, it's a ship arena battle, it is for the um, Grand Arena Championship feats. So, yes. So round one, um, this was a, a very concerning match. We've got a th we had a three forty one speed Darth Revan, and a three thirty three Darth Malik. But my gas clones five hundred first came through. I knew it was going to be expensive. I mean, the way that the kind of really work is by actually having fives uh, sacrifice himself to boost the others and enable the win to take place so yeah it's an expensive one in a way 52 banners however uh i've covered the speeds and i really did wasn't comfortable with anything else than that um i had consulted with my war room and was advised that the other option that i had is incorrectly modded realistically to take on that squad so 501st was the one. The other one I was looking at doing was Padme, but my Padme's, uh, I remodded everything. Um, not everything, but I did do some remodding and uh, it meant that I moved a load of the health mods from my Padme over to my old Daka to enable her, her and Night Sisters to take out uh, Grievous. Uh, spoiler alert, it may appear here. Um, but that meant that the speeds and everything on my Padme squad are a, a, a bit out for realistically challenging a such a good, well, such a well modded uh, squad. So I was surprised. I was expecting to see a Galactic Legend at the back there. Um, happy days. There isn't one, which means that I now have um, full access to my roster so um here we go you're probably getting bored of these i apologize but i'm still yeah i'm still enjoying the fact that i can take out and this is again very well relict very well modded um general grievous squad so um yeah yeah the thing about these is that they do, they always kind of look hairy. Uh, I've seen that you uh, people put venture forward different options on how to run it, i.e., do you run a DACA lead, a Ventress lead, a Mother Towsing lead? I'm, I'm in favor of the Towsing lead because basically every time they use a special, and even you know, one of the specials being DACA's heal revive, um, you're inflicting plague somewhere, um, so you just perpetuating the plague so even if they've got their b1 kind of healing everyone up you're you know reinfecting them constantly but as i say it does get hairy you know we're down to daca and then we do a revive and the spirit comes back and then we lose spirit and now we're back to daca and then all of a sudden all of them are in play get the stun as well on to grievous and bang 55 banners i'm happy taking 55 banners off of grievous more than happy um so yes so we did that there um okay so this one here if you saw already you'll be screaming at me don't do it but i did it uh the error here is what we've got going so we've got commander luke skywalker lead he removes he reduces turn meter on his basic and on his special We've got Han Solo. Han reduces turn meter on his basic. And we also have C3PO who removes turn meter on both his basic and his special. And if you then get Nest stunned, stupidly like that. Well, actually, you don't even need to stun her. Um, 
basically what happens here, and this is now all the way through to the end of the match, is that she is not going to move one inch for three and a half minutes. I'm not going to forfeit it because it's the same thing, but this way round I've got one tune to face rather than the, or the going through and dispatching them all again. So I opted to just go through that. While this is running through, I just want to give Pi Reloaded a real big shout out. Thank you guys for, for giving me a home for the past two months. Um, it really, really was appreciated. Um, yeah, so this is me just actually verbalising it. I've said so in chat and so on. Um, because now I've I've returned to my previous guild. Um, I'm not going to go into all the ins and outs of it, but it was something that's been discussed for quite a few months. However, because I joined Pi Reloaded, um, I wasn't prepared to to move immediately because uh, I'm not a guild hopper. I really am not a guild hopper. Um, you know, I, th I think I can count, maybe I've been in five guilds in total since the, the, the guilds came in. Um, some, yeah, so uh, again, I'm not going to go into the whole politics of guilds and so on and so forth. But I just really wanted to say thank you guys. You, you, you're great. And um, yeah, you have my respect massively. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, there's the maudlin, not maudlin, but there's the soppy bit over and done with, but, yeah, and so, uh, we can now wait for me to time out on this, um, <clears throat> so yeah, loads of things going on, um, which have, have all delayed the upload of, of this, and it was all quite disjointed, in fact, even as I was doing the battles, there were things going on at home and I kept having to stop, put the, you know, put the phone down, go and do stuff, come back to it. Um, I had to chop out a load of, you know, I mean, the, one of the vids was kind of double the length because all it was was me flitting from screen to screen to screen, just checking out speeds and stats and everything else. And it's like, okay, I know that they are of interest, um, but... It it was unnecessary, so I've, I've chopped it all away to to keep these down. You know, um, I'm not streaming these. These are recorded and then uploaded later. So I just want to give you the battles because um, there's there's no opportunity for me here to wait for you to you know, or, or, yeah, for banter with with everyone. Um, I don't have that. This is what it is. So yeah whiz through and i was really annoyed about the fact that i'd put c3 with load of other term meter reducers against nest and yeah i screwed up yeah i did so that means now i have to be quite uh efficient on everything else to undo that so as you can see i'm chasing 1881 um i did get a hold on on my merc so uh yeah i need a and, and the nest mistake has pretty much equalized that so now it's a case of thankfully i've got the target there so i know how efficient i well yeah i do know how efficient or i would have done if i'd have done all the math um but i knew that going undersized is going to benefit me and give me the opportunity of posting higher banner scores so and this one as i say i've seen already that i'm not facing a galactic legend so it gave gave me the opportunity and it's quite a rare opportunity to actually use a luke lead and the benefits of that through uh, um the the group attacks and healing and everything else so as you can see we've got jedi knight luke we've got shakti and then um uh, Grandmaster Yoda and Hermit Yoda. Um, Hermit Yoda's Relic 3 and the rest are Relic 7. So it's a pretty good squad. Um, when taking out this sort of squad, by the way, try and focus down and get rid of Veteran Chewie before you take out Veteran Han because Chewie gets really upset and you normally find out about it and lose banners. 
So that's the, the, the south cleared completely, front and back. Um, I've got the clean up here. Uh, chances are I could have gone single man, but I just wasn't. After being annoyed and dropping banners already, it was a case of, no, nah, no, nah, there you go, 42. I think that's kind of the maximum I could have got on a clean-up, or maybe I could have got 44 on a one-man, but it's Nest, and nah, nah, not, not doing that. So that leaves Phasma left and whatever ships are posted. Um, oopsie. Uh, pro yeah it's quite annoying that you don't i don't you don't have to actually touch on the chat button but if you touch near the bottom of the screen it will quite often take you into chat when all you really want to do is move through zones and this work this, that happens also on territory wars as well um and um territory battles you know how many times you bring up chat when you don't mean to you just want to look on that zone so yeah fat fingers or whatever so again, undermanned, um, liking this one because Bastilla can give all those lovely buffs to Wampa, which is going to make it a lot more difficult for Wampa to get a debuff. And if Wampa isn't debuffed, then Wampa really, really does Womp. And uh, we're just waiting for another Womp from Wampa. So, uh, you know, it's an expensive squad, but then uh, you know, as already covered, there you go, there's a debuff. Phasma got speed down on Womps. But uh, we've got stun on Fost, so Fost isn't going to be able to counter. Um, and we just try and heal back up again. 61 banners. So, again, just making sure that I'm staying on target, uh, especially after clearing my previous round, only to find that I lost by two banners because of my defense being too squishy uh so here we go this is the final battle for this championship round um the penultimate round of course so we go again tonight from 10 o'clock and that is the last round of this season and that's july 20 i, I haven't found a way of of <laughs> set uh, titling them to indicate which season or whatever and, and give me some time and you know eventually i will season them and at least then we can see the progression of of metas um on what we're doing uh yeah so here i'm going galactic republic against um so negotiator galactic republic against uh the sepi droids of grievous um ideally i want the vulture droid that is here gone gone tick that box so in the three car monty sort of thing or follow the ball th there were there were three ships to start with all the additional vulture droids are add-ons and effectively as long as you take out the main ships um you can then uh, kill them and all the other ones will just disappear and you'll get the victory. But you need to ensure that you take out the starting three and invariably there is a vulture droid in there. Um, so that's what I do. That's my idea anyway is get rid of that vulture droid and then I know that I'm facing Sunfac, a hyena bomber and then whatever reinforcements come in afterwards. So this time round it was the Millennium Falcon and that's why I put the Lando's ship in there. I didn't have access to, can't believe that didn't work. And again, finally, it was like really 60 banners. So there we go. So we've actually got the win here. Um, I think we go back through into the menu and then we're going to switch over to a little bonus feature, which is um, earlier on today in my ship shard, I, I found a, this, so this is a, a, a six star malevolence. Um, and I just thought, you know what, let's have a go. So I've put it under malevolence. So I've got one more bounty hunter ship because I need to field four bounty hunter ships for this. I want that ship title. Um, 
and then I've got hyena bomber and a couple of seppies just or a couple of geos to fill in the rest of it and I'm just hoping that the bounty hunters will survive long enough for me to bring in all of them and then still be have a fighting chance of actually getting a full clear um what I do like though and what I hadn't noticed and I don't know whether this is uh, a, a bounty hunter thing is that my IG2000 was going multiple times so there we go so now we've got in the four bounty hunter ships and um, yeah IG2000 is really wrecking on here so in comes their hound's tooth but again a double tap from the IG I mean the IG is not going to last much longer because it infected with whatever it is ship plague i don't know but now you know we're down to we need to get rid of bomber and then we can just focus all our attentions on hound's tooth and see if we can actually get a win out of this which will boom loving that and, uh, yeah cad ship is is a very nice ship um, Yorkie uses it as a, a reinforcement if, um, if my Galactic Republic aren't uh, dazed. It's great to call in and get Annie to support if you've got a Hound's Tooth in there because you're kind of perpetuating the taunt. So it's getting close. My uh, Hyena Bomber was taking a, a pasting there, but did it so achieve the feat thank you for watching